thing because um, I'm putting like mic input into it, so it's covering the the number. I couldn't see the number. Oh. Uh-huh. Okay. Well, we finally filled up, and now we got our we got to wait three minutes. <laughs> Yeah, I got a guy next to me who has a custom tuxedo, dressed like James Bond or something. You wearing a blindfold? No, sunglasses. Come up here and see. Oh, that's a different. It was a guy wearing like a, a blind on his eyes, and he had a tuxedo on in the last match. Yeah, uh-huh, gotcha. Oh, wow. If you if you uh, punch something, your uh, neck extends. Hmm. Uh, I mean, uh, go prone and punch someone, you'll see your neck extend. That is kind of funny. I can't punch now, though. Can only punch if somebody's in front. Yeah, even you, your whole body stretches out. What kind of an it's animation like, is that? It's like the Battlefield 3 bug. Remember that? Yeah. <laughs> well, here we go. Kay. Check the tents. We got a tent right in front of us. No, oh, I gotta stand up. Whoop. Whoop. There we go. Woohoo, armor. Gun. Ammo. Oh, wow, you got an LMG. Yeah, I had the same gun last round, but I... I mean, it, it doesn't really matter if, if you get flanked. Med kit. Wood shield. Okay, we... We best, uh... People are already dying. Should head for that the, the town over there. Okay, uh, is that further in? Uh, that, that's closer to the edge, you know. We might get boxed out by the... Well, let's just go anyway. Oh, let's check the barrier. Uh, uh, okay, the, the okay yeah, the barrier hasn't caught, moved in on it yet, so... But we're going to have to run back the other way. Might run into some people who spawned there. You know, it occurs to me after playing the Division Free Weekend, the one thing I really appreciated that they added since, like, the early beta thingy, or the trial or whatever, is that they added an auto-run button. So you just tap it once and you're constantly running. Oh, wow. Uh, hey, a Wolfstrom yeah. Mark IV. You need a secondary? Razor wire. Yes, I do. 
Painkillers. No, painkillers? Pain. I have a med kit. Okay, I'll take the painkillers. Yep. Okay, uh, there's a supply drop across from us. Okay, coming. Oh, I see somebody. Where? Across, uh, right in front of me. Uh, they put a barrier up. They're trying to jump over the wall and snipe at us. Oh, what the fuck? Crap, they got someone trying to flank me. They got me. Ah, uh, god damn it. Yeah, I think it's safer to shoot at someone and then run into a building and get them to follow you. Maybe. But these people, they're not wearing like green shirt beige pants, so they know what they're doing. Oh, definitely. Okay. Uh, you want to go one more? See if we can last yeah, more than sure. five minutes. <laughs> we may never last more than five <laughs> minutes. But hey, yeah, this is pretty fun. When eventually you get battlegrounds, we'll do that too. Then. Okay, accepting invite. Uh, you you have the culling, right? The what? The culling. Yeah. If you, like, if you want to <laughs> play that, I'll have to re-download it, but that has duos as well. Oh, like, we should the, try the duos it. there, they actually... Planning about the patches to the culling. It, they removed something and they've patched it back in, but I mean, <laughs> you know, they weren't happy. Like, by now they've actually lost their favor. Uh, how do you get up there? Then? I'm going to go to the top of the firehouse. No, I don't know if I can. I don't... Wait, some people got up there. There's got to be a way, right? How do you get up there? Yeah, I don't know how to make it to the roof, not all the way up. Weird. There's... Oh yeah, there's the tilted building. Am I floating in the air? You are? That tilted building really throws you for a loop if you go inside it. It's kind of weird that this all comes from, you know, Arma, which spawned DayZ, then which spawned mods of DayZ that where they took the zombies out because they were never working anyway. 
and people just crafted and shot each other. It became a thing to remove the zombies. Even uh, Rust did it eventually. I think because like it just um, zombies kind of stopped being fun when like you have 200 games doing it and you don't even know what most of them are. If you think about it, Minecraft was the original zombie survival game. Even if zombies aren't yeah. much of a threat in it. <laughs> At least they have other enemies like the creeper. Okay, let's check this tent. Painkillers. Uh, mark the rifle. Windshield. Frag grenade. Hey, uh, you want a grenade? Over here. Armor. Oh, oh shit. I picked up an ACOG scope. Yo, g gun over here. Now, gun. how do I... Gun over here. Gun. Uh, I think you gotta use your inventory to combine them. There's a button for it. Uh, more painkillers out here, uh, where I'm jumping. And yeah. armor vest on Still the ground. Ammo. Medium range scope. Okay, let's hit... 300... Right. Okay, so let me see. Uh, I'm gonna try to drag it to one of my guns. Is that, or do I have to go attachments? Scope. Okay, yeah, I gotta go the tab and then attachments. Checking map. We're right on the edge, so we don't have to worry yet. Yeah, I can't put the ACOG on this. Yeah, doesn't matter. Woohoo, I got a medium range scope for my gun. This should be good. Okay, let's uh, start hitting. Am I going the right way? Follow you, I guess. Uh, we gotta I head gotta towards. Keep my eye open for anybody. Gotta head towards that giant light. That's the way that'll take us away from the barrier. And we gotta keep running, because that barrier can really outpace you in this game. No cars. Funny, I never had a problem with the barrier when I played solo. They must have patched the barrier to be more of a threat. That could be it. I mean, it, mo it moves frequently and it moves fast. And without vehicles, you know, you gotta kind of be running most of the time. You can't stop off for long. I wonder if that giant laser beam kills you. What do you think? I... I don't think you can get close to it. I think I tried getting close to it before because there's like a hole in the ground or something. Gotcha. It might kill you if you... Uh... Let's find out. Yeah, I think I figured out how people get themselves killed. I'm getting pretty close. Oh, you're right. There's an invisible wall. You can't actually go in there. Huh? Well, at least, uh... Well, then, how the hell are people dying if they're not falling in these holes? There's a supply drop to the northeast. You want to head there? Uh, there's one right in front of us. Isn't it the northeast one? Uh, probably. There's one that's still in the air. Um, oh we God, can't I'm get back up. I, I was able to oh. over here. You gotta jump a bit. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna head to the supply Kay. drop. Are you following the one that's close to us on the map or the one that's in the distance? The red one right in front of me. A bunch of people are gonna have their eyes on that one. Yep. I wonder if anybody's on that tower. Flare just went up. Let me scope. Yep. I, that's, I don't. That's I don't see anyone on the tower. Draw. Okay. First, let's go for that tent. Buddy, following us. Don't see anything. Tent looks clear. 
Looks like no one scavenged ah. this. Let's grab all our, all the stuff you can. Iron shield. 600 armor. Wait, no, why did I grab that? Don't need that gun. Oh, 600 armor. Yo, hey, there's a wolfstrom over here if you want to try to put an ACOG on it. I don't know if you can. Okay. Okay, another... Well, let's just... Should we head towards the left supply drop or the right supply drop? The closest one. With uh, the ACOG checking the map. on that rifle. There we go. Uh, checking the map, the uh, right one is closer, slightly. See? Okay. Follow you. Oh crap, I accidentally took my ACOG off. Let me fix that. Oh, I'm off this thing? Nah, uh, you can't even climb ladders. Huh. It's just broken, huh? Great. Okay, supply so drop somewhere down here in this next to this town, where the roads uh, have an intersection. Fifty-four players left. Could be anywhere. Finally, we have a round where we didn't die immediately. I guess it's usually whoever gets noticed first. Everybody kind of just hides out and waits. Oh, there's someone down there. They're shooting at me. I'll try to keep uh, you behind. I put a barrier up. Okay, I I'm a bit further you down. Run back. Running back. They got their own barriers. Where are they shooting from? They're shooting from their own barriers. You see where my shots are going? See their muzzle flash. Okay, I'm gonna lay down and... Oh, I'm dead. I was gonna try to cre eat some painkillers, but Holy I died. Shit. Yeah, but I have painkillers myself. Yeah, you can only gobble them so fast, but that's all you got. I gotta remember to put down barriers faster too. I thought hiding in the bushes would help me, but nope, leaves are not bulletproof. I'm trying to throw a grenade at you. Yep. Not far enough. Well, it's two of them. Four. Yeah. Well. Oh. We tried. Yeah. Yeah, that was a good ah. match. Uh, we still died of the first people we meet, but at least we lasted longer. I got my stuff. 26. Hey, yeah, we lasted more than 64 players. We did pretty well. Good job. So it looks like it's still 100 people with the, with the teams. They're just teamed up. Mm. Okay, thanks oh, for playing. I guess I was looking at the wrong numbers. Seven minutes. Uh. The doc says, don't want you to know the secret. Click here. Okay. Uh, you want to try any more, or that good? Uh, I can go one more, I think. Okay, let's try one more. Uh, oh. Just invite me. And we'll see if we can last Not more than seven minutes. Not lagging for you playing uh, in the Europe region? Like, I, I'm sure there's lag, but it's disguised. We're only engaging people at pretty good ranges anyway, so... We're probably... I, I'd probably notice it more if we were, like, fighting house to house. But at these distances, you know, people are just really far away. Yeah, this time we should get some guns and hide out in a house that's closer to the middle of the map. And just kind of wait a bit. Well, our problem is making it to that mythical middle of the map, you know? <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, cover, you know? Yeah. But, hey, you know, it's always worth a shot. There was this one time I flanked a dude, and he was in a house full of gear. He had, like, shotgun, assault rifle, all sorts of stuff. He, he had no idea I was there. Oh, wow, I found a couple people with spaceman outfits. 
Look like the rejects from kill zone. But they paid <laughs> for those. Or maybe the Nova games. And I never I never finished Nova three, which is a shame. Is it? Is it really? I finished Nova one and two just for three and I <laughs> I didn't play three. I, I mean, think it's is it really a shame? <laughs> you know, you know, the funny thing is, is um, Nova 2 has like a, a a hover bike level. And people are like, how, how do you uh, how do you drive this thing? It keeps crashing all over the place for me. And it, it's like operating on like tilt controls. Uh -huh. <laughs> Nobody knew. So people are expecting to touch screen control at a I, I I thought of it. I was like, how how do you do this? And then they're like, oh, you just you have to steer it like, you know. But I don't sense. think the game does a good job of telling you. Okay, I'll be right back. We're waiting two minutes, but at least it's full up. And one minute. Looks like people are having some punch parties down by the sign. Punch party, punch party, everybody wants a punch party. Punch party. It's like in the War Z when they're having the flashlight party. <laughs> oh, hey, they're creating a human centipede. Let's join. Ooh. Because why not? <laughs> <laughs> it's a miracle. <laughs> How long will it grow? <laughs> Uh, that guy got out of it, and that guy gets in. It's the it's the miracle of life. Uh, everyone's getting up. Oh, all right, all right, because the timer ended. Back to punch party time. Yeah, your uh, your uh, model looks like that dude from I Saw the Devil, but bald. <laughs> Tried to create BD Wong. Failed, but... Oh, hey, an army base. So that'd be interesting. Let me check out this tower. Okay. I've There's never even made it near an army base before. Okay, I got a gun. Pistol ammo. Well, is someone shooting? Um, oh, fuck. Yeah, I was being shot from the beginning. Careful, I think there's somebody right down there. He's hiding behind the porta potty now. Somewhere below me. Can I revive you? Oh, he got me. Shit. Sorry, I couldn't even make it down to you. Nah, they uh, they spawned. They spawned too close. 
Yeah, I hey, think the Mohawk brothers. I think it just spawned a bunch of us at this army base. Mm. And, and yet we still lasted longer than half the players. So <laughs> imagine how many people got gunned how down. Did you die that quick? Uh, gunned down in less than a minute. <laughs> yeah. Man, this really makes me appreciate the uh, uh, the 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 player unknowns spawn method of you jumping out of a plane so you can control where you spawn. I remember someone said something about, like, if you game it, though, if you want, you just don't press the button to get out of the plane, and it'll dump you off at the very end where there's no more room. And everyone who's AFK also gets dumped off in that exact same place. So you go down with them, and you can spawn kill a bunch of people because they're AFK. Of course, someone else might do that, They'll too. They'll probably do something about that. Yeah, it seems okay. I mean, look, if you're AFK, you're going to get shot, right? Don't be AFK. The, the, what's his name? They said that the developers for that right now are uh, on vacation, so any problems are going to be around for, I think, uh, two weeks. Sounds good. Anyway, thanks for playing. Last man standing. No problem. Oh, I was uh, hoping it would be a bit easier to survive. <laughs> yeah. I think I got way luckiest that, that first time I played solo, and I got all the way to, like, 10th or 11th or something. And I'm like, yeah, I'm probably not going to beat that. I was, I think I was among the last 10 to 20 players, and some guy in the leaves actually killed me. But when it gets that low, like, you want to win because it's, it's like, you know, it's... uh. It's intense. Yeah. Oh well. Thanks for playing. And if you go to the armory, there's tons of DLC guns. Wait, does that mean you spawn with them? I don't know. Hmm, that would seem I, to be very pay to win. There are some some uh, Lord Damius Crypt Keeper Decimator, Contender, Bulletstorm. <laughs> Either they're modified versions of the guns that you pick up, so when you pick them up, they're they're like already customized. You spawn with them, that's really they to win. Mm. I guess we're nowhere on the leaderboards, but that's okay. Leaderboard solo. Okay, well, I'll quit this now. Thanks for playing. See ya. Uh, see you next time. I, yeah, I think I'll keep it for a few solo matches. I just want to see. Yeah, it's addicting, how, right? How it is again? Huh? Like you think, like maybe I can do one better, and then, of course, you try it next time. You get killed immediately or something, right? Hmm. But, uh, yeah, that's what duos is like. I, I gotta give this game credit for one thing. I mean, it's got no vehicles, the area's not really very large at all, but um, but made, it does seem crisper. Uh, it, with console players in mind. I mean, it's like, uh, I mean, it runs the, fast, like, and, and, like, the shooting is snappy and quick. It doesn't, like, feel terrible. That's not... It's not a quote from the developers or anything, but like when it comes to console players, like they just want to get into the action as quickly as possible. And other games, they they don't do that as much. You have a huge map. There's usually a big time gap between finding stuff and finding people. This game, you immediately run into people. Yeah, that's kind of a downside, I guess. Too, uh, you find guns quicker, uh, but also. The only weird thing is the the time limit, the three minute wait when you know you're in a when you're in the loading zone. That's actually kind of long. I mean, Battlegrounds is way shorter. It's like a minute or less for that. Well, I mean, it, it has to take into account like all sorts of different people loading into the game with possibly weaker machines and slower yeah. internet. That's true. I anyway. Don't know. Either way, I mean, like all the complaining you can do in the end of the day, it's totally free unless you decide that you really like it and you want to buy, like, a tuxedo or something. Yeah, I mean, it, it's decent for free. I gotta give it that, hmm. you know? It's like not 
a horrible garbage fire. You you can play it. It's snappy. The guns are are fine. You can plant metal shields and to annoy people. As far as uh, as far as Unreal Engine three goes, you, there's a whole bunch of like Counter Strike ripoffs that are just you know, uh, what like stuff that's either made in Russia or South Korea. It oh, so many Korean Counter Strike knockoffs. So many. Yeah, but specifically. Unreal Engine 3 has opened the door for so many of them because they can make something that looks like reasonably good, you know? Also, lots of asset stores, asset reuse. Yeah, I guess. That's it, good if you want to make games on Unity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Better Unreal 3 than Unity. Gotta, gotta admit that. Unity, I mean, you know, you, yeah. has an even bigger asset store, but man, your games will not run well if you make them even there halfway fancy. One there is one Unity game, uh, free to play, and it's very ambitious. And um, what was it called? Uh, Re Red Crucible. That's very very ambitious for a Unity game. That's that's uh, properly pulling off Battlefield. I have to give that to them. Uh. Oh, and man. there's another one. I didn't play it, but it it looks very good for a browser-based Unity game. Uh, I don't know what it's called, but uh, I'll dig it up. It's it actually looks very decent for for a free-to-play browser-based Unity FPS game. That's you know. Remember when uh, Crytek tried to make a browser-based free-to-play FPS? Oh man. I played Warface uh, a lot through the uh, browser. Uh, you needed a G-Face account. Yeah, but, the um, G-Face. My favorite part of that was not being able to install it because I didn't have room on my SSD to install it, it because that was my boot drive. And I'm like, I want to install it to my bigger hard drive. And it's like, G-Face is like, no, you cannot do that. You know? They yep. were supposed to release... Uh, Hunted uh, Horrors of the Gilded Age or oh. Haunted. Yeah, what? That's, that's, I guess that's data. Hmm. That's an absolute shame. Uh, somewhere out there, though, there's a build of it because they did have actual gameplay. Yeah, what happened to all the. It's weird that out of all the Left 4 Dead clones, the one that actually got released was the uh, Vermintide. You know? Oh, that and Payday 1. Uh, yeah, I'll pay it one half count, sure. Anyway, uh, man, these hats are hilariously bad. Okay, I'll see you. Uh, see you next time. Yeah, I'll kill Discord. Okay. Bye. Bye bye.